Hello, my name is Hannah Cooper. I used um, the readings and the video How Possible to find um, the information for this video. I also searched for more layman's terms on the develop the fetal brain development. I was having difficulties with the readings um, and it was very helpful to find a resource that was designed for pregnant people so that they could understand in a in a more basic development way so I found that very helpful as well. Um, beginning in the first trimester uh, right at the beginning three weeks in the head and facial features start to develop as well as um, the neural plate and that forms a tube that becomes brain and spinal cord. So the plate is kind of flat and then it morphs into more of a tube. Um, the neural tube is what it's called. That partially divides into three sections um, and those sections kind of bubble up and become different regions, five regions that most of us are already um, pretty familiar with or have at least heard of. I know we have in this class. Um, the cerebrum, the cerebellum, brain stem, pituitary gland, and the hypothalamus. So those all at the, towards the end or mid, uh, late middle of the first trimester, those start to kind of separate in the, the formed brain. Um, nerves begin to develop and synapses. So synapses start connecting the nerves and the neurons start communicating. So those, those things are the, the parts of the brain that make little, that make movements that connect to each other. Um, so at the end of the first trimester, the fetus will, will be moving. It's not enough to feel, um, for humans to feel through, but there is movement and there's action, lots of action. Um, so the fetus is moving and also has a sense of touch at this point. When the second trimester begins, um, the brain stem starts or the brain starts controlling those movements. So before it was, it was more of just, um, just kind of firing with no direction. But at this point, the brain really starts um, having a say in, in what happens. There, there isn't exactly breathing happening at this point. It's more of a practice breathing. So the, the, lung, the lungs are going in and out and the chest is contracting, but the amniotic fluid is um, coming in and out a little bit, but there's not, it's not considered breathing. Um, 18 weeks, which I don't, <laughs> not so great at week math. I actually find it awful when pregnant people tell me, um, like, I don't, I don't know what that means. <laughs> um, that's when the first kicks can be felt. So, um, my cousin who is pregnant through, um, IVF, her partner was able to feel their fetus for the first time, um, two weeks ago and it was very exciting. So she's going to try to get a video for us to see, but I haven't, um, haven't gotten one yet. So this is also the time when the brain stem matures and the development is really solidifying. Um, the fetal nervous system is developed. Noises can be heard and reacted to. So this is the phase, um, second trimester when putting music against a belly starts and it's encouraged to talk to the belly um <laughs> heard and reacted to does not um does not mean understood so <laughs> that is important to note 28 weeks the fetal brainwave activity of uh, sleep cycles begin and dreaming happens 
I'm not sure what is dreamt about. I think you can only dream of things you have seen. So maybe amniotic fluid? I'm not quite sure. So that's something maybe to look more into. <laughs> um, now we're at the third trimester. So the third trimester is when lots and lots and lots of development occurs. Um, it's really important to note that while the cerebral cortex develops rapidly, the it doesn't quite start to function until full term birth. So I like to think of it as I live in Seattle, so it's very cold. When I turn my car on in the morning, it doesn't already start. And that's kind of what pregnancy is like all the pieces are in place, but it really doesn't start to work and function um, until birth. Um, the cerebral cortex grows with experience after birth, and then we know, you know, it's not fully developed until, I think, 25. I think that's what it is. Um, the cerebellum also develops incredibly quick during this third trimester. I've also heard from um, pregnant people that the third trimester feels like it goes really quick. I think probably that's because all of the fast development. Um, thanks so much. That is what I learned. I hope it wasn't too layman's. Um, I like to think in of all of this in the in the ways that makes sense to me as someone who has grown. <laughs> um, but there is a lot more intricate scientific development. But overall, it's a very speedy process. It might, I think it might feel like a long time, but when you actually go step by step, it seems like very fast. Thank you.